Yo, Dog Testosterone here. Just finished up a workout with my favorite exercise, the fucking deadlift. Very interesting things have happened in the last two days. One of my friends called me and said that he's about to get married and he wants to get his body fit for the honeymoon and he wants some motivation to eat well, to exercise, to sleep, and so he can look really good, get a six pack for his honeymoon. Then my other friend, who is in a kind of a bad family situation right now, unfortunately, he wanted motivation to go to the gym to work out and he asked me to motivate him, make a video that can actually push him to go to the gym because he hasn't done so since September of last year. So it's been many months. And then I started thinking, what makes people motivated? What the fuck is this thing called motivation? Why is it that 10 years of grad school, I didn't work out at all, but then the last three years I've been working out like crazy, moved all the way to Florida to work with the top trainer in the world, right? Why is it for 10 years of grad school I never approached a girl, never talked to a girl, never had a girlfriend, but then in the last three years I had many girlfriends and had a lot of sex. Now, what motivated me to do all that, to get out of my comfort zone, and what does not motivate someone? Now, after thinking of all that, I came up with a very interesting theory. You probably haven't heard this before. So, it is the fact that scarcity is the key to abundance, right? Now, what the fuck is scarcity and what is abundance? Now, these theories, these concepts are very self-development concepts and you may have heard them before, but let me give you my definition. Scarcity is when you come from a desperation, when you come from a need of something. You come from a state of lack. I've been watching Julian's videos, Julian from RSD, his channel is Julian himself. Check that guy out, really amazing. And he talks about this theory of lack. You come from this state of needing something, needing to improve your health, needing to get bigger, needing to meet girls, have more sex, get a better job. There's a need and you fucking go out there and get it. Then there is the concept of abundance. Abundance doesn't come from a need or a lack. It comes from the fact that you already have everything so you don't need to go out and get shit. Okay, now, my theory is that scarcity is the actual key to abundance. So if you have scarcity, you're actually lucky because without it, you're never gonna get abundance. Whoa, you never heard that before. Let me explain what that means. In the brain, in order for you to have the need of something, in order for you to have the desperation of something, there has to be a buildup of a lot of anxiety, a lot of need, a lot of this fucking desire to get something. Now, me for example, when I was in Vegas, me and a friend of mine, we're not uh, friends anymore, but you know, something happened anyway. So um, as I'm speaking to you, I'm thinking of him. Um, we used to go outside of Marquee nightclub and we would go outside and look at the Ferraris and the Lamborghinis for this uh, drive, this inspiration we called it. When we didn't want to go out to nightclubs, we would still go out and see all these hotties, nines and tens, these fucking blonde bombshells to get this inspiration to actually do more work. Inspiration to make money. Inspiration to like get big and like work out and shit, do deadlifts. And we came from this need. But here's the interesting thing. Now, I have abundance, right? Now I have what I always wanted. And the fact that I don't need anything now, I don't come from a lack, I am very positive all the time, I don't need anything, is because I had scarcity first. Let me say that again. Right now, the reason I have abundance, I have everything I want, is because I started with scarcity. So, scarcity, if you're listening right now, I wanna thank you because 
if it weren't for you, I would have never had this thing called abundance. Now, a lot of guys talk about abundance mentality, abundance mentality. I want you to remove that bullshit. You are either in scarcity or you are in abundance. There is no middle. There's no scarcity mentality, abundance mentality. You have scarcity or you have abundance. Now, look at the greats out there. Fucking Eckhart Tolle. You think he started out in abundance? Look at Osho. You think he started out in abundance? If you don't know these guys, look them up. They're on YouTube and uh, they're great mentors to uh, study and and uh, look at, you know, kind of model these guys. They're really amazing and smart. But they started off in scarcity, okay? Eckhart Tolle was gonna commit suicide. I just spoke about Julian from RSD. He had a lot of anxiety from the scandal, the media scandal that ha happened to him. So he also started out in that kind of mentality, right? And now he's realized abundance. Now all these great people have realized abundance. But it all starts from scarcity. Be fucking lucky if you have scarcity. You know why? Because you realize it. The important thing is to understand and internalize that you have scarcity. You have desperation. But from that desperation, from that working hard, your synapses will keep building up. They're like, oh, I need this. I need this. I need this. But then you're also acting. It's not just some desire bullshit where you don't do anything and you're just going to get it. No. You're acting and then your brain is going to build those synapses for your actions, right? So for me, there was a time when I had massive, massive scarcity. Why? Because I wasn't getting girls. I wasn't having sex. My biology wasn't being satisfied. And I had a very scarce life. But remember this fucking thing. Scarcity and abundance are not societal factors. They're biological, right? So me, for example, I had an abundance of academic credentials. I had the abundance of intellectual pursuit, right? I had the abundance, I had the validation of people in the science and academic industry. But that's not biology. You need abundance of biology, at least a certain threshold for you to have abundance of everything. Remember that. If you want abundance of everything and realize that abundance, you need abundance in fucking biology. What does that even mean? The biological urges that you have, be it sex, be it food, be it just exercise, feeling strong, those urges have to be satisfied through a certain threshold in order for you to get fucking abundance. Realize that. Now, listen to me. A lot of people have abundance or they think they have abundance, but they don't. A lot of people think they have abundance. They think, you know, because they have a lot of money, they have a lot of fame. At one point in their life, if their health is fucked up, they are going to suffer and they're going to go into that desperation mode. They're going to start going to the gym. They're going to have to get a trainer and they're going to get their health back in check. So, what I'm telling you is, no matter where you are in life, you need to have a threshold of scarcity of this need to go to the fucking gym. I cannot motivate you. I cannot inspire you to go to the fucking gym. You need to do that yourself, brother. Let me tell you, you need to do that yourself. I cannot convince you to eat healthy because if I try, you might do it for a week right? I get guys who get advice from me. You know, I do a coaching call with them on Skype and they're back on the stupid fucking diet that they used to follow in like a week or two. A lot of people do New Year's resolutions, right? And they break those New Year's resolutions in a week or two or maybe in a few days. Then the gyms are empty again. Why? Because there's no scarcity. There's no desperation. If you want to go to the gym, if you want to get ripped, if you want to have optimal health, then you need to find it in your fucking soul. Why do you need to do that? Where do you need? Where's that fucking desperation? Once you have that, you will go on a path. You will build those synapses. 
You will have emotional connections. You will have memory connections. You will, you will have execution in the prefrontal cortex. All of those different brain parts will come together in synchrony and that is when you will get this threshold of abundance in your biological urges. Once you do that, you will be able to get abundance of everything. And I am very thankful right now that I went on this path going uh, out to clubs seven days and seven nights a week in Vegas for a year with RSD as, their, as a coach and a student, uh, traveling the US doing that, just focused on uh, going into that niche. Then I went to Elliott Hulse for eight months to get that in check. So I had to do that from a state of desperation and now, Thank God that desperation has turned into inspiration. And if you listening out there are desperate enough, have enough scarcity in you. Again, this is not a bad thing. Scarcity is one badass fucking bitch that you want to bang to get abundance. If you have that scarcity, that desperation, that need, that desire to have better health, have a better fitness regimen, get better sleep, and more tangibly, have higher sex drive, get better erections, get boners at clubs when you go out, or you just wanna satisfy your partner in bed. If you want to do all those things and get more confidence, motivation, drive, and you are desperate enough all of that can be done by boosting your testosterone. A lot of you already know I'm Doc Testosterone here. And I boosted my testosterone and now luckily I have this abundance in life and I am very fortunate that it started out with scarcity, now abundance, started out with desperation, now inspiration, and now I'm on my path. If you wanna go on this path with me, click right here to get the Doc Testosterone plan and start your journey to boosting testosterone, optimizing your health, get my videos, my ebooks, my bonuses, all that stuff by getting the Doc Testosterone plan. Again, just click here to do so and start your journey today. Let me know if you have any questions, post your comments here. What the fuck are you scarcity of? What the, what, what the fuck are you scarcity? What in your life gives you scarcity? What in your life gives you abundance? How do you feel in your life right now? Are you desperate? Are you inspired? What motivates you to do what you need to do? What are your biological urges? Let me know, comment below, like this video, and share it with your friends if you think they can also get value from it. And if you want to be notified about my next video, subscribe to this channel. And this is Dr. Testosterone. I will see you next time. Do some fucking deadlifts.